Hello and welcome to the fourth International Conference on Computing and Data Science. My name is Yevo Gamchev and I teach at Queen Mary University of London. I'm very happy to see that there is such a high interest in the conference this year and it is a great pleasure for me to welcome so many colleagues who share our enthusiasm and who have come today to discuss the findings from their latest scholarly work with the academic community. Through organizing this conference, we have the great pleasure and opportunity to bring together researchers and practitioners from academia and the industry to highlight the importance of computing technologies and data science, as well as to establish new collaborations in these areas. The conference seeks to give voice to significant contributions to computing, data mining, and data science in theoretical and practical aspects. The event today was originally booked to be held in the beautiful Macau, but we have to regretfully announce that it will be held online since Macau seems to be going through the biggest coronavirus outbreak since the pandemic began. We wish the people of Macau and our colleagues there a speedy recovery. Having more online events is only one of the many aspects that COVID has had on both everyday life and on academic research. And in these difficult times, governments, businesses, and people look up with hope to scientists to learn how their latest findings can potentially help us to alleviate the difficulties which we're facing and to return to a state of normality. As participants in this scientific conference, all of you have the potential to contribute to the process of making a positive difference in our society. We're happy to have you sharing and discussing state-of-the-art research in fields such as computing, machine learning, and data science. <clears throat> Since we live in an increasingly digital and data-driven society, these areas are already very important in the public and private sector as well as in everyday life. This is because digital technology is now providing us with the tools to collect, analyze, and make sense of unprecedented amounts of data. Various iterations of machine learning are already incorporated in the chain of processing digital information, even when we perform everyday tasks such as using a search engine. The latest research in these types of fields has an impact that echoes across all aspects of society as digital technologies have a wide variety of applications. This gives us a sense of purpose and makes our conference ever so important. We hope that the event will be useful to our participants as they can share their latest findings, receive valuable feedback and learn from world leading scholars. The lineup of speakers we'll hear from is truly excellent, and it is my great pleasure to briefly introduce some of their key achievements. First, we welcome Professor Chung Jong Xu, who is an IEE Fellow, the Dean of the Faculty of Science and Technology, and a Chair Professor of Computer Science at the University of Macau. He is also a Chief Scientist of a key project on the Internet of Things for a Smart City by the Ministry of Science and Technology of China. And he manages a, another key project on intelligent driving in Macau as well. He was previously chief scientist of the Shenzhen Institutes of Advanced Technology of the Chinese Academy of Sciences and the director of the Institute of Advanced Computing and Digital Engineering. Earlier in his career, Professor Xu worked as a faculty member of Wayne State University in the U.S. for 18 years. His research interests are mainly in the areas are of a parallel and distributed systems, cloud and edge computing, and data-driven intelligent applications. He has published over 400 peer-reviewed papers on these topics, and he has been awarded more than 120 patents. This is a truly remarkable achievement. We also have today Tanzila Saba, a research professor and an associate chair of the Information Systems Department 
in the College of Computer and Information Sciences at Prince Sultan University in Riyadh in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. In recent years, her primary research focus has been on medical imaging, pattern recognition, data mining, MRI analysis, and soft computing. She has over four, uh, 200 excuse me, publications that have around 9,400 citations with an age index of 60. Most of her publications are in biomedical research and due to her excellent achievements, she was included in the Marquee Who's Who 2012. Currently, she's an editor and reviewer of highly reputable journals and on the panel of uh, very prominent indexed international conferences. She has been positioned among the world's top 2% of scientists for two consecutive years, in 2020 and 2021, by a research study conducted by Stanford University in Xavier. She's the only female researcher in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia who has been listed in the Guide to Research for the period from 2019 to 2022. We're also very happy to welcome Li Xiong, a professor of computer science and biomedical informatics at Emory University. She has held the Winship Distinguished Research Professorship from 2015 to 2018. She and her research lab, Assured Information Management and Sharing, conduct research on algorithms and methods at the intersection of data management, machine learning, and data privacy and security, with a recent focus on privacy preserving and robust machine learning. She has published over 160 papers and received six best papers or runner-up awards. She has served and serves as an associate editor for many journals, and is a co-chair at a number of conferences. Her research is supported by federal agencies, including the NSF and the NIH. Her findings have been recognized with industry awards from a number of tech giants, including Google and IBM, as well as Cisco, AT&T, and the Woodrow Wilson Foundation as well. She's an IE Fellow and an ACM Distinguished Member. And last but not least, we look forward to hearing from Louis Tung, who is an Assistant Professor with the Department of Computer Science at Boston College. Prior to joining Boston College, he was with the Toyota Info Technology Center. And during this time, he successfully filed several patents on vehicular clouds. His research interests include distributed computing and systems, fault-tolerant computing, blockchain-based systems, and applications in intelligent traffic systems. He has won the Best Paper Award at SSS 2017 and the Illumination Award 2022 at Boston College. We sincerely thank both our keynote speakers and our participants who are with us today to hold insightful discussions on their groundbreaking research. The number of scholars who contacted us to express interest in this conference has been overwhelming, and we deeply appreciate your interest and support. This is indeed a, a testament to the importance of having such discussions as they can lead on a path to making positive impact on a global scale. We hope that the event will provide all of you with an excellent opportunity to learn from each other in your pursuit of further developing your work. Finally, we look forward to holding the next edition of our conference again next year, and hopefully for many more years to come. We wish you the best, and please enjoy the conference.